Hybrid propulsion will change the future of electric aviation. Today, we'll explore how hybrid propulsion systems help us move from regular planes to fully electric ones. We'll talk about their benefits for air travel and the environment. What can we look forward to as the aviation industry makes this shift? By the end of this discussion, you'll know how hybrid systems work, which companies are involved, and why they are important for the future of green aviation. Welcome to the channel. Unlike fully electric planes that depend only on batteries, hybrid systems can switch between different power sources. This flexibility is super important as the aviation industry works to lower greenhouse gas emissions while still ensuring reliable air travel. One of the coolest perks of hybrid propulsion is its extended range. Take Hart Aerospace's ES-30, for instance. It can fly 125 miles using just electric power. But when you add a hybrid setup with sustainable aviation fuel, that range jumps to 250 miles. This means hybrid planes can cover routes that fully electric planes can't handle yet. And there's more. Hybrid systems offer operational flexibility too. They enable quiet electric takeoffs and landings, which is great for cities where noise can be a big issue. Plus, they don't need new infrastructure, so they can easily fit into existing airport setups. Let's not overlook emissions either. Hybrid systems can really cut down on overall emissions compared to traditional aircraft. By sharing power between electric and combustion engines, they run more efficiently, especially during those high-demand moments. A bunch of companies are really stepping up in the world of hybrid electric aviation. Hart Aerospace is making a splash with its ES-30, which is designed for regional travel. This aircraft uses a series hybrid system, meaning the combustion engine works like a generator running on sustainable aviation fuel. It's a game changer for eco-friendly travel. Another exciting player is Ampere. They've successfully tested their electric EEL, which is a modified Cessna 337 Skymaster. This plane is projected to save up to 30% in fuel costs. Meanwhile, Electra is working on a hybrid electric stall or short takeoff and landing aircraft that can operate from just 300-foot strips. They're aiming for FAA certification by 2028. Otis Aviation is also in the mix with its Alta aircraft, designed to carry nine passengers over a distance of 750 miles. This hybrid electric model combines a turbine engine with electric motors, showing off some impressive performance. Now, let's dive into the technical side. Hybrid propulsion systems come in different setups. A partial hybrid uses electric motors to help the main engine during tough phases like takeoff. In a series hybrid, the combustion engine only generates electricity, while a parallel hybrid lets both power sources drive the propeller. This flexibility boosts efficiency and performance. Electric motors are super efficient and often do better than traditional combustion engines. They can provide high torque and power density, making them perfect for aviation. This efficiency is really important as the industry works to improve every aspect of flying. While hybrid systems are a big deal, they also help tackle some of the current challenges with battery technology. Lithium-ion batteries have an energy density of about 200 to 300 watt-hours per kilogram, which is tiny compared to jet fuel's whopping 12,000 watt-hours per kilogram. This gap makes it tough for fully electric flights to cover longer distances. Hybrid systems serve as a bridge, letting us gradually move toward electrification while overcoming these battery issues. They help aircraft operate efficiently on longer routes while still using electric technology. Looking ahead, hybrid propulsion is seen as a stepping stone to fully electric aviation. These systems can evolve into all electric models as battery technology gets better. The FAA is also looking into accepting hybrid systems under current regulations, making it easier for them to be adopted. As the demand for higher payloads and longer ranges grows, developing hybrid electric aircraft will be key to shaping the future of aviation. With innovative companies pushing the boundaries, we might soon see greener, more efficient aircraft in the skies. What do you think? Are hybrid propulsion systems the key to a greener future in aviation? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, you'll want to check out our related video on why is Joby pursuing both hydrogen electric and battery electric propulsion. 
Discover the exciting reasons behind Joby's dual approach to sustainable flying.